is your Rosie Nerdy here and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today I'm going to be talking to you about some more activewear if you guys didn't see by the title or by the thumbnail, duh. So I recently just did my first review um, on some athletic wear because I've been really into working out a lot lately and getting in shape and being healthy and being just the best that I can be. And so my channel is kind of turning just a little bit. It's still beauty, but also, you know, health and fitness, kind of intertwining all of them all together, just because that's just the way my life has, has been. Obviously, I still love makeup. You guys can tell I love my beauty room. I love my makeup. But lately, I've been spending all my money on active wear, and I just don't even know how it started. It started off just with a few items at TJ Maxx and Marshalls, or trying to go to the gym all the time. And then it just took off to where I've had to rearrange drawers and my closet and everything just so I make room for all of my activewear because I have so much activewear from so many different brands um, out there in which I'm going to be reviewing for you guys somewhere later on in this channel eventually going through all the different brands that I have purchased and just telling you what I love about them, what I don't like about them, etc. So again, I thank you guys so, so much for watching. If you guys love videos like this, don't forget to thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. Oh my god, I cannot talk today. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. And don't forget to hit that notification bell down below, you know? So you guys never miss a video with me, your girl, Sandra D. Alright, let's go ahead and get into this video. Alright, so first thing I'm going to be talking to you guys about, obviously, is Walmart activewear. Duh. So, Walmart's been stepping up its game. Uh, for a while now, whether it's been in the clothing department, whether it's been in its activewear. So they have this brand called Avia, which I think is exclusive to Walmart. It is very affordable, very good quality from what I've noticed so far, and I just want to talk to you guys about it. And I recently purchased some few more items to add to my collection since I've never tried a, a few different items from them before because I know... Walmart used to have Danskin in their activewear, and now they're just exclusively Avia. So, yeah, that's changed. I do have some Danskin stuff, but actually I recently got rid of it because I just wasn't about it. Plus, I've had it for so long. Anyways, I keep rambling on. We're here to talk about <laughs> we're here to talk about Avia, um, Walmart's activewear. So I've got a few pieces behind me that I want to talk to you guys about. So I will also put up some videos if I like film myself wearing this stuff as well just like I did in the last one. So first thing I want to talk about are a few of the tops. So this is one of the tops they have there. This is just a long sleeve cotton top by Avia. It's small. It's well, this is in the size small. It's 94% polyester, 6% spandex. It's really cute, very light and breathable. Obviously, if you can tell and it does have the holes for your hands right here. It does have some really cool mesh detailing as well on the arms and also on the side. So it gives you some great breathe, breathable clothing to wear at the gym because we all know we sweat, especially when we go hard. So yeah, this is a really cute top. I got it in small because a lot of the activewear tops that I noticed, um, they don't really have any ones that are compressive. A lot of them are just loose cotton types of shirts and so for the price for this was $11.96 so I definitely suggest when you're looking at some of the shirts to size down because normally in tops for me I'm probably about a medium to large um, I've never been a small in tops but for this one it's very oversized so I definitely got a small in this for sure and then the next item is a, another top that I recently got as well, and this is by Avia, obviously. And I got this in a size medium. So this is 94% polyester, 6% spandex. Just like the other shirt, it is like a cotton type of material. This is what it looks like. And what's really cute about it is it does have this really cute mesh detailing at the bottom, and it goes through all the way. And then look at the back. The back is super cute. Obviously, it has that um, crossing detailing on the back that like scallops 
So it's very breathable, very open. You do have that mesh detailing that goes through the whole entire thing. And the reason why I got this in a medium and a small instead of a small um, is so I can tie the front of it. So it's a little bit more of high, more of like a cropped type type of top compared to just like a really big and overflowing type of top. But it's still cute in general. Uh, the back detailing and the mesh is what really drew me through it. And this is $9.96. So this is only $10. A very cute, affordable workout shirt. We will see how it works out for me. I haven't tried it yet. And then next we have our the leggings that they have there. So they have these in what they call is a flex tech legging. Um, the Via garment has been designed for an active lifestyle, uh, technical fabrics with innovative styling to help unlock the ultimate performance potential. So these are what the leggings look like. Super cute, got a nice little booty contour that kind of curves in a little bit. Um, it does have a side pocket which I think is super, super cute right here. Um, it does have some really cool mesh detailing on the side and then also on the calf. Really, really cute. And then it does have a thick waistband so it is and obviously there's plenty of seams on it. It's not seamless. And then it does have this like jawstring thing in the front if you really want to pull it tighter. I don't really see the purpose of that. A few of their other leggings have the same thing, but it has a waistband, so I just don't understand what the purpose of this is, if there already is a thick waistband in here. And then the price of this was $19.88. So, I mean, it's a little bit more expensive than some of the leggings that I've purchased over at TJ Maxx and Marshalls, and those leggings are super great quality. Love, love, love. The, the brand that I buy, which is 90 Degree by Reflex over there and Yovalicious. And then I got these in a size small, which is a size 4.6. Um, yeah, and then it says performance crop, moisture, wicking fabric, um, reflective trim, innovative, and you get some good compression out of it. Now, I did try these on. They do have some really great compression because of how thick um, the waistband is. So I really do love, love that. And then... They are squat proof, but you do have to make sure that obviously you are wearing um, a type of underwear that doesn't have panty lines. Uh, but in general, they are super cute on. And then, if you didn't notice that this is the bottoms, and then obviously the shirt I bought is the matching top that was over there. Now they did have a jacket as well. I wasn't gonna go so far and grab the jacket because most jackets all fit the same. They're all just zip ups active wear jackets with thumb holes in them but so so far I spent $20 here um, $10 on this shirt so that's about $30 and then $12 here so about $42 and just these three got my hair everywhere and just these three items so I mean that's not really going to break the bank because they're super affordable. I mean, again, I just said the price of this. Can I just, my hair is getting everywhere. Again, like I just said, $12, $10, and then $20. Obviously, the leggings, you're going to spend more for the quality um, and the leggings than you are going to the tops. But that's just that. So those are super, super cute outfits. And then to go along with the color scheme, Avia really has a great color scheme. Some of them are kind of like deep colors right now at the moment, such as like this deep, you know, turquoise color, you've got the, I don't even know what kind of color this is. Is this like a dark red? Is it like a deep burgundy? I think it's more of like a dark red, a burnt red. I don't know, something like that. And then they also have sports bras to match. Now I did talk about these in my last video um, for you guys. But just to reiterate, so obviously you have this one which matches the leggings and the shirt. And then you have this one, which is also in the same color as the other shirt. And then you've also got this purple one. Now they do have a purple top and leggings. They literally have the whole entire color scheme. There's always a legging or a shirt or something that matches a sports bra so you can get a full-on outfit and look real, real cute when you go to the gym. 
God. So you can obviously tell these are super, super cute just by the detailing that's in them. They are super comfortable, super compressive. I will tell you to always to size down in the sports bra because I recently just bought um, this in gray when I bought the rest of this other stuff. And so typically, obviously, I do have a large chest. But when I buy sports bras in my actual size, like which is like an extra large, they seem to be very, very loose. So I like to size down and get a large instead so it's more compressive. So like obviously this sports bra um, is $12.96 and this is by Avia and it says it's a medium support sports bra. But if you want it to be a more of a high support sports bra, then just size down so you have more compression and you're able to tuck the girls in, you know what I mean? So I don't know if I want to keep it or not. I mean, it is super comfortable. It is kind of, I like it when it is a little bit more looser, just so I can enjoy, you know, just some comfortability stuff right now and then. I mean, I do have other sports bras which are really comfortable, like the one I'm wearing right now. <sighs> super comfy. So, I don't know. But I do love these sports bras so, so much. So you definitely should get your hands on them. And also they do have this memory foam padding, which I talked about you before. There are no cup pads in here, so you don't have to worry about that awkwardness of either trying to figure out where they should lay or should you just take them out. I don't know. I love this. I love the padding that's in this. So, so comfortable. And again, these are a dupe for a Gymshark sports bra. I don't know the name of it. I don't even know if I even said it in the other one. But in general, they do it does have this like ribbing at the bottom, and just the really cool detailing throughout the whole entire the whole entire sports bra. So again, super affordable, super comfy, and again, this was only twelve ninety six, thirteen dollars for a really good sports bra from Walmart. What? What is this? And they're in super cute colors you gotta go check it out and then the last thing i also do have another sports bra for you guys to check out oh no i dropped it where did it go all right so but last but not least i do have two more sports bras to talk to you guys about and again they are by via these are super freaking cute so these ones actually do have cup pads in them uh, but you can obviously just take them out but what I love about these is actually this is the first sports bra I bought from my Via, Avia earlier this year. And I bought this in a large because when I bought it in the extra large, it was just, again, too big, too loose, not compressive enough, not holding the girls in like I want it to. And then it's the back that got me. So just look at how super freaking cute the backing is on this. If I could get it to show you right. Um, there you go. It's got this really cute crisscross detailing in it. I just can't. It's so freaking flipping cute. So if you have a few like um, athletic tops that do have like a cutout back, this would be really freaking cute to wear underneath that top. So you still have like a really cool detailing in that keyhole, which I do have a really cute um, athletic top that I haven't worn yet. But I tried it out with this sports bra and it's so freaking cute in the keyhole. I I died. I died. But again, these are just so freaking cute and they have it in black and gray. And then they also have it in gray and white. So super freaking cute. Um, Avia is like slaying me right now when it comes to at least the sports bras. I haven't fully tried out the athletic wear or at least the leggings and the tops but obviously based on what they're made out of it seems like they're going to be great so and I haven't seen heard anything bad about them I actually haven't really seen that many videos of people reviewing Walmart's activewear which is very intriguing to me and very interesting just because obviously Walmart literally rules the world when it comes to department stores and where you can find everything outside of Amazon so I don't know I'm just super excited to try out the leggings, super excited to try out the shirts and stuff like that just to add them to my collection and they just seem so comfy to wear. Oof. And I love a matching set your girl does because you know, if you know you when you want to go to the gym, you want to look cute. So sometimes in a matching set just makes you like, you know, feel good. Anyways, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. 
Again, uh, I don't remember what the price is of these sports bras. I will list them somewhere in this video. I'll try and search it, try and list some links down below for you as well because you know your girl loves to save her money, honey, money, honey. Oof. I mean, if you don't need to break the bank, then why do it? Anyways, I love you guys so, so, so much for watching this video today. I appreciate your time. I appreciate your comments. I appreciate your feedback. And again, don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Don't forget to check out my social medias because I post on there all the time. I've actually been working on some fitness videos. I have one on there so far on my Instagram. And I think I'm going to go to the gym later tonight and take my vlogging camera with me and work out and do some stuff there so we shall see because I don't have a filming buddy I wish I did that would be great so so great if I had a filming buddy um so I could post more videos and do more things but again your girl has to work she has to do her you know do her thing salary life Anyways, don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Don't forget to leave a notification. I ramble on way too much. I feel like I've done this outro so many times and I cannot get it right. Alright, thank you guys so much for watching this video today. I appreciate your time. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Don't forget to hit that notification bell down below so you guys never miss a video with me, your girl Sandra D. And don't forget to check out my social medias. I mean, come on guys. You gotta check it out. Also, I think I still have my giveaway going on on one of my other videos. So if it is going on, I will gladly drop a card right here. Go check it out. You don't miss out on it and I will have some other giveaways coming out sooner rather than later because your girl just loves to give back all right I love you guys so much and I will see you later bye <laughs>